Hey guys, well, welcome to another episode of Mousetrap Genius. You know, we've reviewed a lot of different home lighting products over the years here, but today we're looking at something that's actually really cool, and that is under cabinet lighting. Now, if you've ever been in more of like kind of an upscale type kitchen, you may have seen under cabinet lighting. It just, uh, first of all, allows you to see what's going on on the counter and what you're working on or the food you're preparing better than you otherwise would be able to. But also it just adds a really nice kind of accent or ambiance uh, to the room that you otherwise would not have. Now, the issue and the reason that in the past it was more of a, a high-end type feature is that uh, it was pretty expensive to install because you had to run wires either through the walls or through the cabinets to actually get electricity to these lights. Now, one innovation that we've really seen kind of changing the whole lighting world though over the past several years is LED lights. You've seen that with a number of the outdoor spotlights and floodlights that we've reviewed. Uh, LEDs use much less power, so you're able to just off of regular batteries operate a light for five or six times longer than just a few years ago would have been possible, making it less necessary to run wires all over the place to try and get juice to these things. So that's what London Johnson has done with this puck light, which is designed to be installed under a cabinet to give your kitchen that really nice ambiance of ambient lighting from an under cabinet light. It's an LED with 55 lumens and it's uh, dimmable, which is really nice. Installing it is super easy. Like I, I just can't get over it with how much work you would have had to do in the past to install an under cabinet light. Literally all you do, well, there's two options. You can use screws, which it does come with a little bag with two screws, in which case you just put them through the base plate right here, screw it in, or you can just use a little 3M pad that's included, and that's actually what I did. Just stick it right on there, and then stick the light up under the cabinet. It was ridiculously easy to do. Only thing you want to remember when installing them is to have the little wireless symbol facing outward. To turn the light on, you can just tap it, and there you go. But it also comes with, and uh, this is one of the really cool parts, a little remote. So you can use this to turn the lights on, turn them off. You can adjust the brightness. Like I said, it's dimmable. There are buttons that uh, can automatically put it to either 100% or 50% of brightness, so you can get this uh, just exactly where you want it as far as the level of brightness that you want in your kitchen or whatever room you're installing these in. It also comes with a uh, timer option, or four timer options. You can set them to run for 15, 30, 60, or 120 minutes before automatically turning off, which I think is a pretty cool feature. Now what's really cool also is you can use this to control more than one puck light at a time, which uh, makes things a whole lot easier. These guys are each powered by three standard AA type batteries, which come included in the box when you purchase them. And uh, the manufacturer claims that they run for up to or over 100 hours before needing to change the batteries. I haven't actually done like a 100 hour run test to try that out, but I will say I've run them pretty consistently every evening for the last three weeks here, and uh, they're still going strong. Uh, so, very impressed with this product overall. In fact, I love what it's done for my kitchen here behind me. As you can see, they're there right now. Really happy that the folks at London Johnson decided to send them to me, and if uh, you'd be interested in getting a few of these, or probably six of them for yourself. I'll go ahead and throw the link to them on Amazon down in the video description. Thank you so much for watching this episode of Mousetrap Genius, and I hope that uh, you have a wonderful rest of the day filled with a great ambiance. Till next time.